and I'm pretty sure that just like any conference, AI is going to dominate this conference as well. And if I'm not wrong, you folks are also making some announcement related to uh, AI. One is going to be a my firewall for AI. But I, before I talk about that, I also want to set some uh, kind of foundation for viewers who were watching it. Uh, you folks also run, you know, annual state of app and API security report and 11th report is also out. Can you talk about some of the findings from the report in the context of AI, which will kind of lead us to discuss the Akamai Firewall for AI? The first and foremost, you know, super excited to announce Firewall for AI here at RSA. Uh, but let's talk about, you know, a week or so ago, we did the, the, the SODI report, which is the state of the internet uh, report. And we really kind of look at sort of everything that is going on. And it is amazing kind of data and insights. And, you know, think about it, like, you know, 311 billion web application attacks that we're seeing, 33% up, uh, nearly half of them, like 150 billion attacks are, are targeting APIs. We've seen a significant increase in the layer seven DDoS attacks. And we've kind of step back and looked at, you know, which are the verticals that are getting attacked? It's commerce, it's finance, it's high tech. You know, geographically, the data was, hey, EMEA customers are getting most attacked. Uh, but when you step back and you really start to think about what is happening is that, you know, there's more and more adoption of uh, AI and AI is in, in every vertical, every industry, every, you know, government agency trying to figure out how can I do you know, good, or how can I do better utilizing AI, the tools and the techniques and, and what it allows. And Gen AI, which is focused on sort of like this world of applications and LLMs that are focused on how do you make things better, faster, natural interactions, et cetera, are rapidly exploding. So what is happening is that we see the attacks on the, you know, web apps and APIs. We're seeing the rise of AI applications and the combination of all of these things is starting to talk about sort of, you know, the digital terrain and how AI is impacting, powering it. But we really need to kind of focus on securing AI. And that is what it is all about. It is about securing AI. 